I received traditional training at the National Academy of Fine Arts in Hangzhou, China. I have been in Boston for five years, teaching at Howard Ceramic Program, the Chinese brush painting on paper and over clays. I'm also an artist in residence at the program. When I start a new piece, I start with a simple and weak idea of what shape and texture I want. Then I will let loose and follow the nature course of the clay. I'm very fond of Doris. Chinese philosophy and the Chinese ceramics both have a long histories. The Chinese, since ancient, has a love of nature form rocks because they are beautiful and from nature. They are also very modern as they are not totally representative but very abstract. So in the past few years, I have been thinking how to bridge the tradition with the contemporary art. Clays and porcelains are very unique materials. Ceramic rocks can be placed horizontally or vertically. I love to make this. I love to make them because they have free forms and can be appreciated from different angles. Firing is the biggest challenge because it determines the final product. It can be a happy surprise and it can be a disaster. Preparing the kiln and the firing requires high technical skills. Today, I'll be firing a few pieces of Chinese scholar's rock with Saladon glaze. It's my first trial and it's important to me. <laughs> 